And we back. And this will be going through how to get multiple model outfits all at once, just like you guys requested in the comments. Since this video is already very, very long, I'm going to keep this intro as short as possible. If you guys can please subscribe, we're coming up to the big 60,000. And it'll just really help me out. Also, I'll really appreciate you. Also, if you get a thousand likes on this video, I'll do a female outfit version. So if you guys want to see that, make sure you do like it. Also, if you guys could like it because how long this video took, it's probably the most time it's ever taken me to make a video and all that. So I'll appreciate if you could like, and if you want to be an absolute real legend, subscribe. But now let's get into the video. Let's go, boys. All right, so start on your main character. So your male character, and it needs to be in slot one. If it's in slot two, it will not work. From here, you got to go and delete all your saved outfits, but your favorite one. Unfortunately, that's the worst part of the glitch. You can't keep any saved outfits but one but trust me in this video i'll be showing you guys four really sick ones plus in future uploads bro i gonna i'm gonna set you guys up if you guys want to keep seeing this i'll keep posting it plus this allows me to post as much as i if as much as you guys want if you guys want me to post daily i got you from here you want to go and just swap into creator make sure the one outfit that you want to save is the outfit that you're wearing so go over to jobs and then go and click swap character from here, it's going to take you to a screen where you have your male and female character. Once you're in it, you do need to delete your female character if you already have one saved, so you could create a new one. If you already have progress on one, it will not work. So uh, there's a few like requirements, but if you guys are about the outfits, about the GTA drip nowadays, that's what you got to do. So I'm just going to go, as you guys can see, I have no one made, it's just a random character, so you just got to go and edit it. So select it, start editing character. If you already have someone there, delete it and then just create a new one. You might lose your stuff, but again, you do keep your rank and you keep your money. From here, it does need to be a female. So I'm just going to do that quick. We're just going to make it real quick. So switch that to female. And let's go down to appearance because we ain't going to keep the basic. Okay, I shut my eyes. Three, two, one. Stop. Ew. No, 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 I'm not leaving that. I ain't leaving that. Show my eyes again. All right. Three, whatever. Just stop. Okay, that's better. I couldn't look at the last one. All right, now let's get into online. From here, you just want to go save and continue. Take your picture, and it's going to load you into online. It's going to give you the option to skip tutorial. You do want to take that. Also, it's going to tell you like the whole diamond casino cutscene. So, right here, do you want to skip? Yes, confirm. Then you're going to get the whole Diamond Casino cutscene. Just wait for that to end and you guys will be okay. Right when the cutscene has gone, just head to the nearest clothes store. You do need some money for this, but your money transfers over so you guys should have some. It's around 100k I think total for all the outfits. So it's not that bad. You're getting some sick outfits from it. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to make all the outfits real quick. And it's just to save some time and then I'll see you guys once they're done. Alright, so I just made all the outfits. From here, I'm going to try to do this part as quick as possible. But copy exactly what I do. So for the first outfit, this is going to be the Galaxy and Checkerboard. We're going to start by going to Gloves and buying 4 to 64. After this, we're going to head over to Shoes, head to High Heel Boots, and then head down and buy 24 to 55. From here, we're going to go and head over to Pants. Then you want to buy the Black Crop Jeans, number 38 out of 70. Then head down to Shirts, go down and buy these Leather Bomber Jackets, 6 out of 19. From here, go and head over to hats, head to canvas hatch is the second one, and then buy the second last one, 78 out of 79. From here, go and save this outfit in slot number two. So leave slot number one empty, and then put slot number two and name it Galaxy 1. All the names, copy exactly what I do here. It's organized, and it'll help you guys a lot near the end of the video. I'm trying to speed run this because I know you guys hate long videos and I do too, so I want to make this as quick as possible. So for the second outfit component, we're going to go and head down to work jackets and buy number 9 out of 17, the peach one. Then head down to gun running t-shirts and buy 60 out of 60, which is the last one. From here, you want to head over to shoes, go to high heel boost, which is the second one, and buy number 24. After this, just go and save this outfit as well. And now save this in the third slot and name it Gorka 2. I mean Galaxy 2, my bad. Now we're going to go with the Gorka outfits. From here, you want to go and buy this red scuba suit, 20 out of 22 at the bottom. Then head over to gloves and we're going to buy the merge gloves right here. So go head down and we want to go and buy number 4, the light woodland tactical. And then we just got to go and save this outfit. This one's very, very simple and very quick to do. Save it in the fourth slot and name it Gorka 1. 
Now for the second component, Gorka 2, we're going to go, we got to head down to Sports Pants, buy the first one. Then we're going to go and head over to Tops. And we're going to go down and buy this black bikini, number 27 out of 30. You won't be able to see it since it's under this jacket that we're going to go buy right now. Go to Tactical Jackets and buy 79 out of 79, which is the last one. After this, we're going to go head over to shoes. You're going to go back to these high heel boots by 24 to 55. Once again, you guys will already have them bought from the outfit number one. From here, just go and save this outfit as Gorka 2 in the next slot. For Gorka 3 now, we're going to go and head down and buy 19 out of 17 under work jackets. And then we're going to go and buy gun running t-shirts once again and 60 out of 60. Save this outfit as Gorka 3. Now for the first Tron outfit right here. We're going to go down and go buy this biker cut right here, 50 out of 76. From here, we're going to go down and buy this black bikini once again. You can do this with a t-shirt, but it automatically puts the black bikini on anyway if you buy a t-shirt. So, I mean, either one works, but just go with the black bikini. It's easier. It's also free. From here, go. You want to keep the same pants you just had on, which are those sports pants. Number one out of 54. You gotta put the tactical gloves back on if you took them off. So 4 to 54. A lot of these components are now repeats. And then from here, by the black slack boots, 35 out of 94 under the boot section. Then go and save this outfit as Tron 1. So now for the second merge of Tron, we're gonna name it Tron 2. Again, it's very similar, but we gotta keep making these over and over. So go down and buy Work Jacket Peach 9 out of 17. Then head down to gun running and get 60 out of 60 once again. And go and save this outfit as Tron 2. That's another one down. Alright, so we're on the last outfit. It's going to be the Trash Man Vest plus the Gorka Pants of your choice. So go down and buy 50 out of 54 under the glove section, the black woolen gloves. Head over to shoes, go to the first one, which is boots, and buy number 49. These red ones right here. You don't need to head to hats, but head to actually head over to shirts. We're going to go down and get tuck tank tops and buy number 94 out of 99. From here, we're going to go up to Leather Jackets by number 32. It's this JC one. And from here, go and save this and name it Trashman 1. Name it right under the Tron outfit. For Trashman 2, we're going to go back to the gloves. This time, we're going to go and buy number 4 once again. From here, we're going to head over to the tops. We're going to go and head up to Tuck T-shirts to get Black Classic. After this, we're going to go and head up to number 9 out of 17 under denim jackets. And then we got to go and save this outfit as Trash Man 2. For the final outfit we need to make, we're going to go and get this, uh, what's this thing called? Party Tank Top and Leopard Loose Tank, which is number 1. After this, we're going to go to Biker Cuts, not Biker Cuts, but Tactical Jackets and buy 79 and 79. And go and save this outfit. Okay, we did that pretty quick. I started messing up at the end, but I think that was okay. If you, I was going too quick for you guys, I'm sorry. I'm just trying to like help everyone out. Because I know a lot of people do complain that it takes too long. So just put the video speed slower and just copy the gameplay if it's too fast. I'm just trying to go quick, you know. I ain't trying to waste your guys' time. From here, make sure you have all the outfits the same as me. So as you guys can see. And then just take the easy way out. Wearing, it doesn't matter which outfit you're wearing. But I suggest putting on number one. It just makes everything easier, you know? From here, you're going to go and spawn outside of the clothes store. And all we want to do is we want to make sure we get a little yellow loading symbol that it shows it's saved. So from here, we're going to go. And if you didn't get it, just switch your outfit, run around a bit. And you'll notice bottom right, you have the little loading symbol. From here, all we got to do is head over to online. Then go and head to creator. And you want to start up a creator. What we're doing here, we got to create a race. So I'm going to fly through this part again and making it as quick as possible. If you guys don't have a social uh, club account, I'm pretty sure it's called, you're going to need to make that real quick. All it requires is an email, password, and I'm pretty sure that's it. From here, you want to go, click Create Race, head down to Create Land Race. And there isn't too many things you need to do here, but just make it. So put the title, doesn't matter what it's at. The only important thing is put the maximum players to three, and then put the super and put the point to point. From here, just go place the triggers. I recommend heading to the airport, and you just got to create the race, so put checkpoints all over the place. It does need to be at least one mile for it to work. After this, you just got to go and test it yourself.
All right, so we just finished testing. You get this. From here, you want to save it and then click options, head to online, and choose character. Now we're finally about to go back to our male character. From here, you want to go and delete your female. So make sure you're deleting your character too, not your main one. So from here, go and delete. You're going to have to type delete, and when it takes you back here, as soon as you can, click circle or B to return. And it's going to take you into solo. Again, if you guys seen I was level 1 there, it's because I'm on a new account. It's not because it resets your rank or anything. It's because I was playing on a level 1 account for this glitch. It, does, it also doesn't reset your story mode. Again, I'm on a new account. I've never done anything. Once you load into story mode, though, you just want to go and start a go or an invite-only session. Either one does work. If it only you're more safe, but it doesn't matter really because you're going to be starting many jobs from now on. This is kind of the long part of the glitch now that gets very repetitive. So get used to these type of parts. From here, you just want to go and save your favorite outfit that you saved from before. So you'll notice you go to saved outfits and you have all the outfits here. So go to your last slot, 20 at 20, and save this outfit that you're wearing. So it'll be whatever you want to keep. So if you guys had like white joggers, I know a lot of people like that. That's what you want to keep. So now, obviously, we're not able to access any of the outfits that we have saved, so we're going to need to do a job glitch. And this part doesn't take too long, but it's very repetitive. So to start, you want to go and buy the effortless standard outfit. So after you buy that, just make sure you're wearing it and take off all accessories. So you're going to have glasses on and just throw those off, because that's going to mess it up. From here, go, and we got to start the job Crooked Cop. If you guys don't have an earpiece, though, buy that real quick, because you do need an earpiece once you're in the job. We also need to go and buy this racing jersey right here. Whatever one you like the gloves, but 17 out of 17 is the best for this glitch. So do 17 out of 17. Just, yeah. From here, now we want to walk outside and start the job Crooked Cop. Head to online, click jobs, play job, Rockstar created, then versus missions and Crooked Cop. Start it up. If you're still watching, I kept your attention for this long. You must have been enjoying something. So if you guys can, you guys already know, like the video. You do want to host, or you could join another person, it doesn't matter. I'll be doing this all with randoms. People join this job like crazy, so it's technically not solo, but it's pretty easy to get people in it. From here, we just got to go and put player owned on. Then throw auto invite on and start inviting people. That is one of the most important steps still, putting player owned on. It starts on classic, so make sure you do change that. As you guys can see though, a few seconds later, look how much people we got in the job. So people, for whatever reason, join this like crazy. So And a lot of people are doing this glitch at the same time as you. So you guys will be good. Trust me. Like I did it with all those randoms for every outfit. Once you go down, you want to go to own outfit and go two to the right. You'll notice you get your modded outfit. Then confirm ready up. And they'll put you into the job. From here, all we got to do is throw in an earpiece. So go to style, accessories, put on an earpiece. And leave the job through your phone. As you guys can see, the person around to the right of me was doing it as well. Right now, we're going to load back into online. It'll put you into a public lobby. From here, just go and save the outfit. So I'll see you guys once we're in the lobby. So we just loaded in, and as you guys can see, we got the sick. This is probably my favorite outfit out of all of them. Checkerboard plus galaxy. From here, we're going to go and head to the gun store or the clothes store. Either one works. So all we got to do from here is save this outfit. There's a few other steps with deleting. So follow these exactly what I'm doing here. So from here, you want to go edit your saved outfits. Head down to the bottom and save it in the last slot that you could possibly save it in. So for me, it's 19. From here, you want to go and you want to delete the original two. So Galaxy 1 and Galaxy 2 need to be deleted. Now we're going to go and get this Gorka outfit. So this is the fully invisible torso plus a blue Gorka and cop belt. It's another one I think you guys will really like. From here, you don't need to put an emote on. I don't know what I'm doing. But this is the outfit. Let me know what you guys think. Also, let me know once you watch them all, which one's your favorite? One, two, three, or four? I would say number one is mine, but you guys want to? You guys can let me know. From here, we want to go down and buy what I'm about to buy right now. Which is going to be this blue biker suit right here at the bottom. It's free. So just go to outfits, go to biker suits, and buy this blue and white one. From here, make sure you're wearing it. Make sure you have no accessories on. And now for the second time, you got to launch Crooked Cop. This is the part that I'm saying we're going to have to launch Crooked Cop five times in this video. So it gets repetitive. But from now on, you're pretty much doing the same steps. The only things that are different is going to be the outfits that you need to launch Crooked Cop while wearing. 
So, again, make sure it's on player owned. If it's on classic or themed, it will not work. Invite two random people. Head down to owned outfit and go two to the right, three to the right this time. And you'll notice we get cop belt, fully invisible torso, invisible arms, plus Gorka pants and white shoes. Then just ready up, wait for it to launch into the session, and repeat the process. So again, from here, throw on the earpiece, go to style, accessories, one to the left, go pull up your phone, and leave uh, once again. Now, just like last time, it's going to take you on to online into a public lobby, and you'll be wearing the modded outfit. Also, I think I like this outfit too. A lot of you guys asked for invisible torso, so this is it. That's why I included it. Plus it has the cop belt again. Another thing you guys requested. Also, you guys made it to nearly the 16 minute mark. It really helps me out if you guys subscribe. Like, it really, really does. You make my dreams come true. So, if you guys can, if you're hearing me talk right now, please help a brother out. It means a lot to me. From here, go save this outfit and delete your components. So, go over to saved, edit, and save it again right under the galaxy. So, now this time it's going to be 18 out of 20. Once you save it, go head up and delete your three Gorka outfits from the female. So name it whatever you want, and then go to edit the saved outfits once again. Alright, so Gorka 1, delete. Gorka 2, gone. Gorka 3, gone. Now, for the final, well not final, second last outfit, Black Joggers plus Yellow Tron. I also think this one's pretty sick. For this one, you can't do it in the gun store, though. You do need to go to a closer because you gotta edit the pants. So from here to start, go to Racing Tops and buy this one right here, the yellow one, number 4 to 17. Also put a standard outfit on before, and then you want to go and put on utility pants and put on these heist pants right here, 38 out of 38 black heist pants. This is going to allow you to get the black joggers onto online. From here, go and start Crooked Cop on once again. So jobs, play job, Rockstar created. Versus Crooked Cop. I'm just going to skip until we're in the job because you guys already know the process from here. So we in, head down to owned outfit, go two to the right, and you'll notice we get the Tron outfit ready up from here. Throw the earpiece on. This process is the same once again. The only time it changes is for the last outfit, which I'll show you guys right now. And we got to do one little step a bit differently. So wait for the second player in the job to ready up. You'll load in here, hold the touchpad, put on. In your piece. Also, this does work for Xbox and PS4. I don't know if I've already said that, but if you guys, if I didn't, here it is. Throw the earpiece on. It doesn't matter which earpiece as well. Leave through the phone. Now, once we load in, spawn right outside this store. We're just going to run in across the street. Save the outfit, delete the other two. And for the last one, so the most fun because you actually have customizability over it. That ain't a word. I don't even know why I just said that, but I'm leaving that in. I'm not cutting it out. What is, what's the actual word? Customize? I don't know. So again, <laughs> I don't even know what I'm saying. Again, go and save this. Name it, whatever you want, but save it on 17 out of 20 this time. Go delete Tron 1 and Tron 2. Bang, bang. And now we're going to do the trash man. So for this, you're now able to edit whatever Gorka pants you want onto it. So start by going to Gorka suits and whatever one you like the pants of. So which one should we go with? It's going to be with the Trashman vest. Um, I think these. These look like a vibe. Yeah, we'll go with these ones. Anything else better though? Oh, no, no. We're going white. Yeah, yeah. Those ones are, those ones are way cooler. White and red. We'll go with these. So from here, you guys already know. Start up Crooked Cop. This time though, it's a bit differently once we're in the job. So I'll see you guys once we're in. Alright, so we're in, but this time, don't scroll through all the Trashman outfits. So when you switch your own outfit, just switch to Trashman 1. Don't go to 2 or 3. So you'll have this ugly outfit right now. Don't worry, it switches. <laughs> From here, what you want to do is just leave again after you put the earpiece on. Bang. And then leave through your phone. So now, once we go in, a quick little process. We've got to head over to gloves this time. This is where it gets a bit different. Because this is going to allow us to get the invisible arms, and then we're going to have to restart Crooked Cop so we could get the Trash Man vest. So once we go over to gloves now, you'll notice we're actually able to put racing gloves on. This isn't normally an option, but it's a free thing right here, number 42. Just click it, and you lose your arms. There we go. From here now, we got to go and delete that saved outfit, which is Trash Man 1. Make sure you still have Trash Man 2 and 3 saved, though. So again, from here now, go to saved. 
go to Trashman 1 and delete that. So now from here, make sure you still have 2 and 3 and go start up Crooked Cop for the final time. Finally, we're done with this mission. Let's go to Jobs, play Jobs, Rockstar Created, launch Crooked Cop real quick. And for the last time, we're going to finish this process. So once we're in, go to Trashman 2, go to Trashman 3. Confirm, ready to play, wait for everyone else to. As you guys can see, my teammates are doing it with me as well. So they're putting on this random stuff. Their outfits are kind of ugly. I think we got the best outfits out here. Again, now that you've seen all four of the outfits, let me know which one is your favorite. I'd probably rank them from number one being the best one, and this one probably being the last, to be honest. From here, throw the earpiece on and leave your phone. We're finally done with this. Again, it's super repetitive, but we finally, finally finished. So just head into the store, save the outfit, and pretty much that's done. I'm going to show you guys all four of the outfits all together. But make sure you do have a great day. If you watched all the way into the end, you had to like something. If I kept your attention for over 20 minutes, you know how hard that is. <laughs> you guys have to like something. Please subscribe to the channel. It means a lot, a lot to me. Save this outfit, delete the other two trash mans, and we're done. So that's be it for the video. More importantly, do have a great day though. Peace, boys.